DeRosa and her friends are getting their message out. Isn't it great? I get good fun from the hog. And if there's any problem, it may be that they're too effective. It's funny when um, passengers are reaching over their driver to hog up. This is video one member of the group shot on October 20th. Those are CHP officers, and they are telling the demonstrators to get off the overpass. The group believes that they have case law on their side, that they have every legal right to protest on an overpass like this one. What is less clear? Flags and signs like this, and whether it's legal, to attach them to the side of the overpass. But as for being on the overpass itself, they've sent this letter to CHP, demanding an apology and asking for assurances that officers won't try to curb their free speech rights again. CHP has told us they won't hesitate to kick the demonstrators off again if they thought they were causing a traffic hazard. All your vehicles are driving by you at 75 miles an hour, looking up at you, reading your signs and honking their horns. They're not paying attention to traffic. Do you believe it's safe for the people driving by? Yes, I think it's safe. I mean, we're no more of a distraction than a street sign is. DeRosha points out that the group has staged dozens of demonstrations like this in the past without a single accident. Uh, not only has the group asked CHP to give them a break when they're up here demonstrating, they've also demanded a formal apology from the state's highway patrol by this Friday. CHP says well, they intend to continue enforcing the law as they understand it. And we will be monitoring